Hey, long way fellow YouTubers, it's Sunday, February 2nd, 1.27 a.m. Denver time. I had a noise complaint here at the motel and haven't got back to sleep since. It's amazing how much I miss my Mandy, and I can't say that too loud because my lab, Tasha, but it is just freaking amazing. Talk about a hole in your life. Dr. Paul Cottrell. His YouTube channel is just Paul Cottrell, C-O-T-T-R-E-L-L. -L. I was a little late on this. I hear all these YouTubers recommending him because the HIV combined with the uh, the coronavirus. You know, that was a little slow. I didn't believe him. <laughs> anyway, who is Dr. Cottrell? Because that's important, right, when we listen to anybody. Uh, Dr. Paul Cottrell received his BS and MBA from Wayne, Wayne State University. Ph.D. from Walden University and pre-medical circulum from Fordham University. He is currently at Harvard University for an ALM in biology. His research includes using chaos theory to mine, model financial markets and economic emergence. His work on economic emergence contains new theoretical concepts of economic evolution and the creation of self-organizational structures. In addition, Dr. Paul Cottrell has published works from his Harvard University studies in genomics, neurobiology, neurosurgery, endocrinology, and microbiota, if I'm pronouncing microbiota. Anyway, I started with his one, it's 35 minutes long, Coronis, coronavirus and HIV paper. Then I went through, I would, that one's 35 minutes long. I went through that thing at least three times backtracking, trying to understand and get to know this stuff more like we, we all do. We're all not Harvard and neurobiologists and all that neurology and microbiologists and all that crap. This dude, I'm going to recommend this dude more than I've ever recommended anybody in my freaking life outside of YouTube. He sounds so much like he knows what he's talking about and he's serious and sure of himself. Now, maybe every one of you and a couple of us here that is on this channel have already went and listened to his stuff. If he is right, and he sounds like he is, and this is a coronavirus, a bat SARS, combined with HIV, and that's what he states over and over, they were trying to splice, cut, copy, paste, whatever, a SARS, a coronavirus with the HIV, so it would attack or go around or completely annihilate your our, our immune systems, then we are in deep, deep shit. Uh, he even, at one point, he even talks, I, I, matter of fact, I think it was in that article. Oh, what was that from? It doesn't say a whole too much. It's somebody plugging themselves at the same time plugging him. Uh, it's light lightonconspiracies.com and it's the leak projects in on this. I don't know how much I trust them, but I'm, I'm trusting this dude, this pocket trail. But if, if this is even half as bad as what they did with this, then man, you, you better really watch out. Forget all other stupid truth or crap and they're overhyping this or underhyping that and trying to do their sales and forget all that horse shit. If this dude is right in what he's talking about, it sounds like he is. Even if if he's right, and I believe he is, and this HIV is spliced into this coronavirus, even if the coronavirus doesn't get you something else can because of what this HIV coronavirus is doing going to do to your immune system. So even if you don't get sick or do get sick and survive this, it fucked up your immune system. And this 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 is just something freaking horrible and I'm believing every word that's coming out of this dude's mouth. Uh, now we're going to just move on real quick to this whole burning bodies things in Wuhan. All that, oh, I forgot to write it down. All this is coming from some reporters from this uh, digital media company called in 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 Intuitum or something like that. I'm sorry, I was gonna, I didn't even write this down. They are a digital media place based out of, I believe it was Hong Kong, started up in 2015. In 2017, they were taking such a money loss, they went from 90 employees down to 20. 
Now, consider the source or lack thereof. They're the only ones that the only source of this all over social media, YouTube, and everything else. And they are saying that they are burning bodies in crematoriums, plural, at 700 a day. So let's just take two crematoriums. I tried to Google MapQuest crematoriums in Wuhan. It didn't work out. So they're using plural crematoriums. So let's say two. So let's... There's, that's what they're claiming they're burning 1,400 bodies a day. I don't see it. Nobody else is seeing it. It's just them, and they spoke to employees at all these crematoriums. I don't think so. And no pictures of bodies stacked up. No, no. And so the, all this media stuff is not on lockdown. Yeah, you know, I mean, even if they shut down Twitter and YouTube and the Internet, they would have to shut down the phones too because you could take a picture and text message it to somebody. But anyway, back to the... Uh, his, his uh, YouTube channel is Paul Cottrell, not Dr. Paul Cottrell. Man, <laughs> go watch these videos. It's just incredible. And if this is literally what they did and what's going on, it is going to get bad. Now, like they're, everybody's reporting, the uh, infectious rate is higher than SARS, but the death rate is lower. Now, if somebody, oh, I remember seeing, I'm, I think I came in that same article, they're saying, there's no telling how they got this out, whether on purpose or some disgruntled employee, and then they show a map how it's 20 miles from the bio lab in Wuhan to that market where it supposedly broke out. They said it could have been a dis, uh, disgruntled employee drove, driving by and throwing out a Petri dish. <laughs> We're never going to know. Like I said, if they tell us the truth, we wouldn't know. We wouldn't believe it, so who gives a shit how this supposedly started? anyway, if he's right about this being in there, I mean, this is bad news, especially, I mean, I, th I think he even said, I think it was in that article, this thing can mutate from cosmic rays, you know, just because of the way that crap works and all that. But anyway, I think we better really pay attention to that if this dude's legit, and I believe he is. Anyway, until next time, bye.